Welcome ladies and gentlemen, my name is Kid Lee, and this is going to be the data Datacron Guide for the Planet of Terrace. The first Datacron is a plus four to presence and is located in the Teleron Marsh. The area that you're looking for is this area here, just to the northwest of the 75th Legion forward camp. Uh, you can kind of see there's sort of a, a rock wall here, but basically there is a tunnel right in here. And once you enter in the tunnel, you'll want to work your way to the big room all the way at the end. Alright, we're entering the uh, large open area here, and you can see right up here is the Datacron. We'll slowly make our way up this direction. And there's a just a small amount of platforming that goes along with this one. Basically, you'll jump up onto this pipe here. And then from here, we'll jump onto this platform. And then the next platform. And then go ahead and grab your Datacron. The second Datacron is a plus four to aim and is also located in the Talaran Marsh area. Uh, this one is located just to the sort of northeast of the 75th Legion forward camp and you can see where I have my character located. And what you're looking for on this one is this particular area here. You can see sort of a piece of a down building, but what you're looking for is you're looking for this pipe over here. And you can go ahead and start scaling up the pipe here. And you'll drop down over on this side. All right, from here we'll just make our way along the the debris and I'm gonna switch over to on foot mode here jump up on the side of this little building here and then jump off go ahead and mount back up and continue along this direction there's a little bit of gapping here so Make sure you jump that carefully. Switch back to on foot mode for this little section here. Go ahead and just do a little jump on that. Got a bit of a longer jump on this one. Try and hit that corner there. Nice jump there. Take a look at the map here real quick. So you can see we've gone from here to here already. And there's a gap here. You'll have to make sure that you jump that. Go ahead and get on top of this one. Now we have to make a jump here. There's a gap here as well. This one is a little tricky. I think it's probably best to use a mount and to try and do sort of a an angle jump a little bit. And there we got it. From here we'll uh, jump onto this next section. And over there you can start to see the, the blue glow of the Datacron. Now we'll switch over to on foot mode again. And it should be home free from here. The third Datacron is a plus four to cunning and is located in the Burl Settlement area. Just south of the Bomber Command Post, you can see where I have my character listed. From here, we are going to enter this building, and it is an abandoned pirate cave. Now if we take a look at the map, you'll just go through this area here until you reach the elevator. Once you reach the elevator, we'll go ahead and take a ride down. And we'll take a look at the new map we have here. What you'll want to do is just follow your way through this map until you reach this square room. 
And if we take a look here, as we enter the room, you can clearly see where the Datacron is. Now this one requires a little bit of platforming here. Uh, first of all, you can start on this uh, sort of bulldozer tractor they got going here. And we'll just make our way up this. Maybe. And then from here, we'll jump onto this next platform here. And then we'll jump onto some piping. Alright, on here you'll want to make your way to the top box here. And you'll have to make your way over to this piping and then onto this set of boxes. Alright, we're getting closer. You can see the data cron right over there. Jump up on these boxes and we'll make our way over to this next set of boxes. Now this is probably the trickiest jump in here. I don't think you want to jump straight on. I think you want to do sort of a, an angle jump is the way to go on this. Give yourself as much almost running room as possible. And there we go on that. Should be pretty easy from here. Don't uh, don't miss that jump now. There we go. The fourth data cron is a plus four to endurance and is located in the Republic Resettlement Zone. Uh, we have the Crater Command Base, and it's just north of that. You can sort of see where I have my character listed. There's a broken wall here, and we're looking for a point basically right in this area. Now what you're looking for is there's along the road here there is this sort of shelf along the broken wall. What we're going to be doing is we're going to get on this shelf and make our way along to this open area. So we'll jump up onto this area and we'll just follow along the wall here. And we're going to just keep doing that for a little bit here. Just trying to inch our way along here. Alright, and you see up ahead here there are these two platforms. So there we got the first one. And we'll go for the second one. Now from here we're going to jump down and make our way across to this short sort of reddish brownish area. Do have some uh, jump here. You make your way down. And now we have to basically get on this pipe. So we'll make a jump there. And we'll actually make a jump here. And then as you can see, there's a ledge down below. We'll just come over here and we'll just do a drop down onto the ledge. And from here, we'll do a little bit of a jump and run along this area. Now we have a nice big area down below here that has sort of a a hole in it where we're going to fall down to this. And then down here we have 
sort of a reddish orangish brownish color we'll jump down to that and as we inch our way forward you can see the datacron and just keep inching your way forward you'll land below and go ahead and grab the datacron the fifth and final datacron is a plus four to willpower and is located in the sinking city just to the north of the forward outpost alpha you can kind of see where I have my character listed uh, kind of amongst all this debris what you're looking for is this giant sort of knocked over or sideways metal structure what you'll do is you'll come up to the side of it and you'll basically make your way up to the top alright once you get to about this point you'll want to do uh, a fall onto uh, this platform down below and then make your way over to the, sort of this guard rail type area and you'll want to jump and make it into uh, basically over this wall and into this little area right in here might take you a couple of tries there we go and then you will get to this point and this will be your first sort of uh, test when it comes to jumping Let's see if we can make this one and there we go and slowly make your way along this area you can kinda get in the center now and make a little jump here We'll jump here, a little drop here. Now you'll need to make your way out to the tip of this metal. Now as we look down below, you can see sort of a wall and then a piece of metal that sticks out. You are looking to basically jump onto this metal that's down below. So you try and get the, the best angle you can and then go ahead and make the jump. go ahead and heal up and we'll go ahead and move on here there's no jump here but you can go ahead and make it anyway go along the side of this building here and we have another small jump and on here try and work your way in on the sort of darker area go ahead and jump up on this ledge and tiptoe your way onto this one and we can finally see the datacron there off in the distance now you're going to have to make a jump here and there is a gap for safety reasons if you want to jump here it's maybe a little safer and from here you should be home free go ahead and grab your datacron <laughs> 